What's up guys, Matt from footballboots.co.uk and today we'll be helping you guys with something that we get so many questions about. We'll be showing you exactly how to spot fake websites online who pretend to sell genuine products from the likes of Nike and Adidas. To show you guys just how sneaky and on the ball these fake websites are, here's a picture of Feyenoord player Elgero Elia who's holding a customised pair of Superfly 5s in a unique colourway. And what fake website foot shoes have done is create and sell an exact copy although not even being released by Nike in that colorway. So you've been watching our boot videos and find the perfect pair for your taste and foot type. So it's now time to head online and make the purchase. Now instead of taking advantage of the black and orange 10% voucher code from Level Soccer on our website, you try and find them even cheaper elsewhere, but how can you tell if they're real or not? Let's help you guys out to never be hustled again and work out if boots you've already bought have come from fake websites. So let's jump online straight away and start with the absolute basics. The 16 Plus Pure Control were an absolute smash within 2016, proving one of the biggest sellers which also meant endless fake websites were stocking cheaply made versions. So what happens if you literally type in cheap Pure Control boots? Well you obviously get the big football boot websites for the first few hits, but then appears the domain names which aren't as noticeable. Sportkicks.uk stood out as a potential red flag, so we clicked onto the link and saw what was going on on their site. The first strange factor was how you needed to enter a variation code to proceed onto the website, something I've never had to do before. So I entered the code they wanted me to and waited to see what loaded up. After a couple of seconds to load up, I instantly knew it was a complete scam, as I've probably seen the page layout hundreds of times. The fake company had actually stolen almost the exact same website layout as Lovell Soccer, however placed their cheap looking sportkicks.uk logo at the top left hand side. Even clicking onto the please select size tab and the layout just wasn't right. Most real and trusted websites show the available sizes from smallest to biggest, but sportkicks.uk had mixed theirs in a strange order. For somebody that wasn't aware of how Lovell Soccer's website looked, then they could be fooled by the Sportkicks setup. But one thing you can almost guarantee is how an Adidas A16 Plus Pure Control would never sell for just £77.19. The biggest rule of thumb with football boot prices is how brands like Adidas and Nike will very rarely sell below 50% off from the original price to cover all the appropriate costs. So going from £230 to £77 is just too unlikely. So moving on to what other product Sport Kicks had to offer, we clicked to see all of their Adidas models and what a surprise we were given. The first product they offered for just over £60 were a pair of boots that I had never seen before. A pair of Yeezy 350s in a unique green and black colourway. Who's a fan of these boots? Remember that they're fake even if you like the design. Phone our poll card now whether the price is just too good to refuse or if fake boots are a no-go no matter how they look or how cheap they are. I guess a factor to point out is how younger kids who are looking for football boots online may not have as much street smarts as others, so if they see something like these never before seen Yeezy 350s, then they could think they've discovered something special at such a low price. But that's just not the case and the point of this video. But how else can we tell that websites or boots might be fake? Well going back to the Adidas product pages, and we can see just how many colourways that there are that haven't actually been released. Most noticeably the pink, red and purple pure controls, which look incredibly bold and no surprise Adidas never opted for those specific paint jobs. A couple of other notable points is how the Sport Kicks website uses multiple thumbnail pictures, which isn't the case for real stockists who commonly have a set angle across all models and brands. I've also never been onto a trusted website like Level Soccer and seen in the title how each boot starts with the word cheap. You can pretty much take it as a rule that if a boot starts with the word cheap, then it's more than likely a cheaply made boot. You really can tell from the highlighted text at the top of the page how the fake website has copied the same layout style as the trusted sellers with matching tabs and wording. So what's happening with the rest of the Sports Kicks page? Well on the left hand side you can see some reviews from supposed buyers, however it is clear to tell that they've just been written by the fake company through a lack of real comments and feedback. They're just general remarks all with 5 star ratings. Getting back onto Google and searching for arguably the most hyped football boot on the entire market, we wanted to see the cheapest and fakest Nike Recruit Superfly 5 we could find, and it wasn't difficult at all. Typing in cheap Superfly football boots into Google, as that's what most young players or parents would do, interestingly the first websites to appear on the list weren't the ones we expected. The first several domains all had strange links called iOffer, DHgate, Speed Passion, Jordan XB and of course AliExpress, who are probably the most well known website for showing fake Nike and Adidas products within their listed products from external sellers. Going straight for the first website, we checked out iOffer and the first pair on their website was a Stellar Pack looking Superfly 5. 
almost exactly the same as our custom made pair, but again, never actually made by Nike, so clearly a fake. At just over $80, if these Stellar Pack looking superflies were in fact real and at that price, you're probably looking at the greatest find of all time. Unfortunately, this is just too good to be true. Different to sports kicks, I offer had actually created their own website. Well, we had never actually seen this layout before. So they went to extra lengths than other sites who just copied well-known sellers. As you can guess, there's a lot of made up colorways on iOffer, similar to the pure control scene before. And it seems that the fake websites have been on their chrome sole plates as they gave various Superfly 5s a metallic finish. Although the only iridescent sole plate on the boot so far was the EA Sports Limited Edition model. Deciding to click onto the white and gold Superflies, the main giveaway that these could be a fake pair of boots were the basic and amateur pictures on the product page, including a thumbnail of the boots actually in action, something very rarely seen. Scrolling down to the bottom, and no shock, there's several top reviews from supposed buyers across the globe, including India, USA, Australia, Ireland, and so on. They do this to make them appeal to everyone around the world. But what they really do is taking your money for rubbish quality, and that's even if they actually send them. Interestingly, there's also a few negative reviews, which could be from genuine buyers who state how the quality is alright, but they receive the wrong size. But if it's a real review, then it shows how you can't trust what you're buying. We then decided to click onto various other websites and the two common themes were boots at impossibly low prices and also colorways which are never created. And moved on to Soccer KP, whose background was the layer of the Mercurial Superfly 5 launch and therefore very outdated. Something a real seller would continuously keep to the newest of looks. Soccer KP also add in their About Us section how they have thousands of satisfied customers, but we can assure you that players who have bought from fake websites have complained about the quality and craftsmanship. If you're looking for boots online from less well-known websites and aren't sure if they're real, the best thing to do would be head over to our website where we list all of the newest boots in every colorway it's been in. You might even find a great price option there too. The final piece of advice to stop you from getting ripped off is to try and avoid the online selling platforms like DHgate and AliExpress, as is endless amounts of fake boots. Just stick to the well-known sites as not only will the boots be real, but the companies will also offer you the best return policies, exchanges and refunds. We hope it helps you with your future boot purchases and don't forget that you can get 10% off from our website using the Love & Soccer Black Orange discount code. Let us know any stories you may have about buying fake boots. Thanks for watching guys, cheers.